Hi folks, um, this short video is actually meant to accompany our architectural change application that we'd submitted to the HOA back in April 14th. Um, we still haven't gotten any feedback from the HOA regarding this. We were hoping to speak with someone to figure out what can and cannot be done in the side yard, first of all, before we proceed with uh, actually drawing up the plans. In the meantime, however, I've um, taken the liberty of uh, putting together a two-dimensional model in a 3D program to try to illustrate the problem a little, a little bit better, and I'll be submitting the actual plans with the uh, application. Picture, if you will, uh, to the right-hand side here. This is our neighbor's house, and our house is to the left here and this is our common yard. So in the back here, those two segments represent the backyard fences. Currently, we don't have access to our backyard at all. In order to get to our backyard, we have actually have to traipse across this usually very marshy land um, onto our neighbor's path and then cut back across here onto our yard. This entire area is a planting area that has pretty uh, significant shrubs and bushes. I think they're overrun. So what we were proposing is to have a path of pavers be built from the front door's landing area to our backyard fence, uh, the gate. And uh, to maintain privacy between our houses, we still have a land a planting area here that we could plant shrubs. And uh, we have two windows here that would effectively be hidden by those shrubs. Um, I do have some high-quality pavers I'm willing to donate to the job. Uh, and I'm willing to donate them to our neighbor as well if he chooses to have this path built up for his backyard as well. Um, and... Uh, Let's see what else. Oh, in the plan I also mentioned about the gutter downspouts causing this marshy area. So let me point that out here. Essentially what we have is the gutter downspouts coming from the roof on these two, uh, sorry, these two boxes here represent the columns going up to the roofs. And the downspouts, the gutters downspouts, just empty right into this yard here. And so this yard usually gets very marshy and uh, we're afraid of, uh, you know, uh, West Nile virus because of mosquitoes. So we actually know that there is an underground pipe going from the backyard to the street. Because if you take a, a, a hose and you pour it into one of the drains from the backyard, it does successfully drain out onto the street. So what we're proposing is to have this drain also tied into the uh, drain pipe underground here before this landscaping would be added. I believe that's it. Uh, that's it in a nutshell. Uh, as I said, I'll be submitting the formal dimensions I took here along with the uh, change request. Uh, but please do contact us. We're eager to get this solved once and for all, and I think right now would be a perfect time. The weather's beautiful, so um, I guess uh, the ball's in your cart. Appreciate any help you could offer. Thank you. Cheers.